So today we're gonna to be showing you how to manually update your GoPro Hero 12 Black without the app. It's really quite simple to do. Maybe you don't have access to the app right now and you just wanna do it with the memory card and a computer. Really quite simple to do. So let's go ahead and dive right into it. So the first thing we need to do to update the firmware here on our GoPro Hero 12 Black is remove the memory card. So let's go ahead and open the side door here. You can pull back on the little lever and open that door. It's easiest I find to remove the battery to access the memory card. I should mention to do this update process, make sure your battery is at least 20% charged is what they're saying. So make sure your battery is charged before you do this. Now here you'll see your memory card right there. We can just go ahead and push that in and it should eject it. It'll pop out a little bit and we can pull that out. We do need to put information on this memory card before we put it back in the GoPro to do the update process. Now we do need to plug our micro SD card into our computer to get information on it. And commonly your micro SD card will have come with an SD card adapter. If your computer has an SD card slot, you could use that to connect it to your computer. I have a USB-C to micro SD card adapter there. You can also get USB-A to micro SD card adapters. If you need one of those, I'll have them linked below in the description, but I'm gonna be using this micro SD to USB-C adapter today. So I'm gonna plug that in here and I'll just go ahead and plug this into my computer. Jumping over to my computer here, head on over to gopro.com and we're gonna scroll down to the very bottom. We're gonna see an option that says product software updates. You can go ahead and select that. And from here, it's gonna ask you which camera you have. And of course, I'm using the GoPro Hero 12 Black. So we're gonna select that. Make sure you select the correct camera. You don't wanna select the wrong camera and install the wrong software. So we'll, we'll go ahead and select that. In here, it'll talk about updating with the app. If you did wanna do that, it'll talk about the latest releases, which conveniently there was one yesterday. And here at the bottom, it says update your camera manually. Now you can do this on a Mac computer or a Windows PC. The process will be slightly different for the computer part on the Mac, um, but I'm sure you'll be able to figure it out. We're doing this on a Windows PC today, so I'm gonna go ahead and select that. Now it will give you some instructions here on how to do this, um, but at the top, it says download update. So we're gonna go ahead and left click on download update and you can see it started downloading it here to my downloads folder. So we'll let that finish up here. As it's doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and load up my downloads folder here. So on a Windows PC, head to your start menu and I'm gonna right click here, not left click, but right click. And I should see the file explorer option right here. We'll go ahead and open that up and we'll click on downloads here on the left hand side. And you can see that my update folder has downloaded right there. Now this update folder is a zipped folder. You can see the little zipper on it. So we do need to extract that. So we're gonna right click on the little folder here. And in the option menu that comes up, you should see an extract all option. So we're gonna go ahead and left click on that. It's gonna ask us where we would like to extract that to. I'm just gonna extract it here in my downloads area, but you can select a different area if you like. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit extract and you should see another folder pop up that has no zipper on it. So that's the one we're gonna be using today. Now, if you have done this a multiple times and you've got a folder that says update one and update two, make sure you don't copy those over to the micro SD card. We wanna make sure we're doing this with the one that says update only here. So let's go ahead and find our micro SD card here from our GoPro. So under this PC, I've got several drives on this computer. I've also got one called USB drive and I happen to know that's the micro SD card from my GoPro. Yours might have a different name so you might need to search around for it a little bit. When I click on that, I've got some um, folders here, DCIM. There's also getting started with GoPro, et cetera, over there. So let's go ahead and copy that folder over here. So if I go back to my downloads, make sure you grab the correct one without the zipper. We're gonna drag and drop that into that drive. Now you could also copy and paste it in there if you like but I'm gonna drag this update down to the USB drive here and just let it go. And it's gonna copy that over. And if I click on that, you can see it says update. And again, make sure there's no one or anything like that after it. Now from here, we're just gonna go ahead and right click on that drive and we're gonna go ahead and hit eject and eject that drive. And we can pull that micro SD card now out of our computer. So now we're ready to put that micro SD card back in our GoPro here. So we'll open up that door there. 
and we'll put it in the slot. We'll slide it in and you give it a little push there and it should stick right in place just like that. We'll grab our battery, slide that in there and close the door and we are ready to do the update. So starting the update is extremely easy. Make sure again that that battery has at least 20% left on it and we're just gonna go ahead and power on our GoPro. We'll hold down the button there and it should start up and it'll start updating right again. It finds that folder we put on there and starts updating. So we'll let this do its thing there for a little bit and we'll come back to you once it is complete. The GoPro restarted and the update is complete. It really only took about a minute or two to do and it's really that simple to manually update your GoPro Hero 12 Black without using the app. So if this tutorial was able to help you update your GoPro Hero 12 Black manually, if it did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe here on YouTube. And YouTube thinks you should watch this video right up here next, so why don't you check that one out. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, take care.